It's Mr. Zing and Tuppy. Well, it's time for more fun with Mr. Zing and Tuppy the Tiger and all their friends in Cartoon Land. And now here's Mr. Zing. Hi. This is a uh, quite obviously a puppet set where on occasion we talk to Mooley and the Moolah's cow. Poor frustrated thing, but she's a very nice gal. This is Beep Beep from the planet Oo. This is Gwendolyn Scrubbergy and Alhambra Scrubbergy. They spend most of their time in trees, and when they're talking, which they're not doing right now, fortunately, it's impossible to get a word in edgewise. We have a lot of fun with the hand puppets, and the children seem to like them a lot. So do I. This is a cage wherein, upon occasion, we find Tuppy, our tiger. Tuppy doesn't like the cage too much, so whenever we put him in it, he very easily just takes the door off and away he goes. This is Leafy Bark. Leafy Bark is a talking tree who has a great big deep face voice and talks all about oh, school work and things you should and shouldn't do. And he's full of a lot of very, very nice ideas. And over on the far side, we have such things as uh, Shaggy Dog's Dog House and our bleacher area, where each day we have from 35 to 50 whim, wigger, and vitality filled youngsters. From from the ages of 1 up to 12 or 13. This behind me is my office, and we use it as a kind of a starting play, a point for our little bits of action. Here I have a unicycle, which I learned to ride a few years ago, more or less. Now let's see if I can get on it. One, two, three, there we go. I have a little bit of trouble handling it. Okay, that, that's, that's enough. You got your point across. This is Tuffy, the tiger. Tuffy has been with us since the beginning of the show and a very, very integral part of the show. As a matter of fact, he's a star. This is Shaggy Dog. We've added Shaggy recently, and uh, he's probably the only dog that is filled with a uh, man with a master's degree. <laughs> now, uh, these two fellows help me out, not only in action, but also they like to, to help me out with little morals like don't hit each other and uh, don't eat with your fingers, be kind at all times, and try not to break the furniture, and for goodness sakes, don't ever, ever do anything like pull practical tricks on people because, you know, if you're mean to people, then people be mean to you, and we try our very best to make sure that no one is ever mean to anyone else on this program. Well, maybe occasionally. 